Well, it is a job that would come with plenty of challenges, even if it weren't in a pandemic. In tonight's Rebound Report, Q2's Russ Riesinger catches up with the new Chancellor of Montana State University Billings to see how things are going so far and what she's looking forward to in the future. Um, starting a new job in the middle of a pandemic has been really interesting. It's real nice to meet you. It's nice to meet you. So I'm just getting to know everybody. All the girls are flocking to them, wondering where you can get those sweatshirts. So, I, know. I know. Meeting new people with masks on and recognizing people and, and knowing who they are. And even something as simple as not shaking hands to follow those COVID protocols has been really hard for me. The COVID-19 pandemic has changed the way things are done in just about every every field, MSUB's new chancellor says it's been a wake up call for the way education is delivered. We've had a crash course in, in doing classes differently, being more flexible to meet students needs, and I think it will change education forever. What that looks like, we don't know yet, but it makes us step back and look at how we can do things differently in a way that meets students needs. And that's really important to me. Dr. Stephanie Hickswa is one of the newest Yellow Jackets on campus. She's only been on the job a few weeks. The first woman chancellor in the school's 94 year history that that work ethic that I have and that perseverance and to want to do the best I can regardless of the job. I grew up on a ranch in Dillon and that has just been instilled in me from from a young age. You know, running a ranch is a lot like running a university. The only thing that's that's really different is when you run a ranch, you harvest in the fall. Um, when you run a university, harvest is in the spring. That That's graduation. Raising the completion rate for MSUB's approximate 4,000 students will be one of her priorities, she says. It's something she had success with in her previous job as president of Northwest College in Powell. Finishing a degree sets them on a path to success forever. And so I think it's important for all of us at MSUB to focus on helping students complete. Despite some of the uncertainties for the moment that have been brought on by the pandemic, Hickswa sees a bright vision ahead for MSUB in the next five years. There is so much potential for MSUB. I think that being more integrated in the community in the next five years is one of my personal goals to look at what the needs are of the community, especially in the healthcare arena. We can really tap into that because Billings is a medical corridor for the entire region. Construction and renovation on MSUB's Yellowstone Science and Allied Health Building will be completed this year. It will feature state-of-the-art laboratories and equipment connected with classrooms in the science and health fields. I think that we can really look at what our strengths are in the healthcare area, in business, in education. Our special education program is, is one of the best in the region. We can capitalize on those strengths and, and find some of those niches and really, really work hard to make those a bigger part of what we do. Rather than being everything to everyone, we can focus on what we do well and just take it to the next level. In Billings, I'm Russ Riesinger reporting for MTN News. All right, thanks so much, Russ.